Well, good afternoon. I'm down at the um, the Market Hill Rally in Luton for the uh, NUT strike and the, the rally we've just had. Uh, phenomenal speakers today. And I'm with someone who's a teacher who's going to talk to you a little bit about some of the stuff that's been going on um, uh, in teaching and how it's been affecting uh, the profession. Hi, my name's Graham Thorpe. Uh, I work at Bushmere Primary School in Luton. I've done so for about 12 years now. I've been teaching for about 27. Um, one of the things I'm on strike for today is the cuts that have been happening in our pension. Uh, I've been paying my pension since I started, 26, 27 years. Last April, the government forced through measures which will see me pay more, about £50 more a month. Get more, get less when I'm uh, actually retire and actually work longer, and I have to work till I'm 66. Some of my co younger colleagues who are here today will have to work till they're 20, until uh, they're 68 uh, before they can retire. And I don't think anybody wants to see a class full of 10, 11 year olds with a 68 year old teacher in front of them. It's just wrong. Some of my younger colleagues, also to meeting, um, it is about pay for them and the conditions that they've got. One of the teachers at a meeting recently said. I don't pay into my pension, I can't afford to pay into my pension and run a car to get to work. It's that kind of choice that they have to make at the moment. So I do feel for them. Um, I mean, that's uh, been echoed across the, uh, the rest of the public sector and in the fire service as well. I mean, just to give you a little bit of context, we had a new scheme came up in 2006. Um, this is where the 60 thing came in, working to 60. Um, the, the contribution rate for that was set at 8% for new members. So everyone that's joined since 2006 on that new scheme will be paying 8%, but now the government are increasing the contribution rates up to 13.2%. And that's a massive pay cut for people. So that the people are now um, having to choose, as one person said to me, between uh, bread today and jam tomorrow, is how they put it. Um, you know, over £300 out of uh, firefighters' wage going into a pension that they may not get to see. Um, so, you know, pricing people out of a pension after the Queen earlier this year said that her government was going to help people save for their retirements. So it's uh, it's a scandalous, really. Just today, that they're going to make um, the sort of compulsory enrolment into uh, pension schemes. They uh, rolled that out again today. It is ridiculous, um, and uh, you know, uh, you know what, like you say, it's a, it's a scandal, really, the changes that they're pushing through. Well, one of the things that um, came to me when that young lad spoke at the end, actually, and um, you know, it's something that I use quite a lot in the fire service when I'm trying to get people engaged with what's going on is that these jobs that we have, they're not our jobs. We're just custodians of them for the future generations. And when that young man spoke at the end, uh, you know, reminded me of that point. It's something I would you know, like to have raised, but um, it's good to see uh, a good turnout today. And at the next one, I'd like to see, hopefully there'll be more. It is good to see people coming out. It's always good to see people coming out, but we've got a lot of young teachers. We need them to come out as well. Um, come along to committee meetings, get involved at every stage that they can for the union. Uh, if it's just coming out on a rally when they're on some strike, that would be great. But get involved. People need to get involved. Because otherwise, if you don't stand up for education, for the fire service, for other public services, then they won't be there for us in the future. And it's it's frightening for me. Well, there's a Fire Brigade Union rally on October 16th. It's a Wednesday, so you will probably be teaching. But, <laughs> probably will, but... but yeah, if you've got any friends and family who want to come down to it, they'll be more than welcome. Oh, thank you. Anyway, thank you for your Thanks time. Much Have indeed. a good day. Take Cheers. Care. Cheers. So as we say, people not banks at the market rally, Market Hill rally in Luton.